When the college opened in 1993 as Southwest College of Naturopathic Medicine, it was that this was going to be an innovative school and that this was going to be a school that had great ambitions for its graduates to become leaders, for the care that we provide here and in our community clinics to transform patients' lives, and for us to embark on research that really make a difference in the world. 30 years ago, there were about 35 naturopathic doctors in the state of Arizona. Without a lot of practitioners here to support it, this was a school that started in an old elementary school with a single program. And despite its small size, quickly moved to this beautiful campus. If you think about how daunting a task it was to start a school from nothing in the desert, I think that was the first achievement. For years, this was a single purpose institution with never more than 425 students. And yet, we've been providing free care in underserved communities for 26 years. We are sitting in a LEED Platinum building, the Neil Reardon Center for Regenerative Medicine the launch of the School of Nutrition, and then finally, the Rick Scalzo Institute for Botanical Research. All of that really changed the s &M experience. It astounds me how much we're able to achieve. And, and when I reflect back, I'm most proud of the people who've come here, whether it's our students, our staff, our faculty, the people who join our board, the people who volunteer, the people who donate to Sonoran University, who without them, all of this is just like an idea or a vision. But thanks to their dedication and their passion for helping people, these dreams become reality. Now going into, I would say the second generation of this institution as Sonoran University, we're gonna go even further. The university rests on three pillars. You have education, so students who come here to learn, faculty who come here to teach. The second is community engagement. And since 1996, we've expanded those long-standing relationships. And then finally, research, generating new knowledge that relates to the healing power of nature, which is the medicinal properties of plants. It's important for Sonoran University of Health Sciences to be a leader in healthcare. The majority of illnesses that humanity faces today, not just here in this country, but now worldwide, are chronic diseases that have their roots in how we live in our lifestyle. Number two, as we learned from the pandemic, there are many emerging uh, diseases, viruses, or antibiotic resistant bacteria that are problems today and are going to continue to be problems in the future. And there is no better institution to help address these problems than the Sonoran University of Health Sciences. So I think whether it's the type of healthcare that our students are learning, the type of healthcare we provide to our patients and the communities we serve, and then the research that we're engaged in, this is a university that is critical for the future of healthcare.